former finalists fighting for one of those top two spots, fighting for a position in Madrid. Because remember, if you get top two, you get semi-finals, and that means you are going to Madrid. It was on a Ghost Poro, so was spotted out trade in the mid lane as well. The Drowsy down on Betsy, but Perks now needs to get away from this. Fight still happening on the top side. The stun combo is enough, and G2 get first blood to be able to walk away from this one. A bit of a CS lead down towards that top oh, lane. Oh, Joko's on the just chasing in. Good rupture, oh. but Joko will start tanking up now, and Wonder's dead. No way for him to get away. Joko! Oh, oh, what? <laughs> The mid lane, though, remember, hasn't got, got no the flash, flash has yeah. portal jump, but is he going to be able to get away from a Ragnar rocking Olaf? No, he's not. That's one down, and Yankos can do nothing about it. The arrow comes in, the utility AD oh. can be catches Joko, and now here comes the chase. Kjarnan and Tom Kench coming up with it there as well, but Joko almost falls. He turns oh. it back around. Yankos, flash, prison, cleanse from Betsy, but Kjarnan and Wadid are here. Finally, the realm whoops get him away. Betsy uh. will oh. live to fight another day. Pick, put him on a playmaker like the Zori. It's really exciting to watch, but we're going to find the bot lane here. Yeah, Nuke's not, not in the best of positions. Glacial Fisher comes out as well. Yankos there. The there prison connects from long range, and that's one. Jokov now comes in, trying to turn on to Hyanan, and we did, but the Abyssal Voyage will get them to safety. Is Yankos going to be able to get out of this difficult spot? I don't think so. Kill will be given across to Betsy, who gets it in the end. Just runs at people. Basically, what he's doing now... Just flashes the Legitimately water, runs at people. Hyanan. It doesn't matter if you're good at utility AD carries if you're dead! See, I agree with that. It hasn't been amazing. Wonder's gonna try and start the fight here in the mid lane as we get back onto the game. Cleanse and flash from Betsy. Glacial Prism misses. Yankos there with Did jumps across the wall, but he hasn't got the Halo Blade, so he can't get enough damage down. Eventually, Betsy will fall. With Did's the one to get it. Oh, he's trying to into Runder here. Has Finish that wit's end and has the black cleaver, so it's doing a lot of damage to this choke out just trading into him. Perks. Gonna go towards the mini pretty soon, and then he'll get that extra range advantage. Wonder's gonna fall before Perks can even get there. Dodge oh. to the side from Ruin as well as he missed. And follow up because he has the cleanse. Still back as an Ezreal is notoriously slippy and he has the sash. What? <laughs> oh my god. Perks still standing off towards the side. The Baron down to 2,000. Joker's going in, looking for the steal. Can't get the smite because choke out secures it. Nah, going for the inhibitor, but already Nuxalot is down. And Giants need to run for the hills here, they need to get away. G2 gonna use the enhanced recalls. Let's look at that inhibitor though in the top side. Let's look at the Nar, the sleep does connect. Betsy's still alive, turns it back onto Perks with the cleanse away. The paddle is gonna be enough with the final auto in. Betsy, G2, continue to force in. Great Glacial Fisher, but the prison lands onto Nukes. A lot jump in from Ruin. Ooh. The Nar, three members, but Shannon is still alive and he can do work on these AD carries. One down, the sleep lands as well, but Joko will be unstoppable for the moment. G2 could try and push in here or they could reset. They do have super minions pushing in mid and that bottom lane now. And G2 took a while to get the advantage in this game, but once they got it, absolutely, they just run away with this game. And still back is having some kind of really horrific yeah. flashbacks. It's not, a CD not bubble fun there. playing against Perks when he is hitting these bubbles. Once again, another one connects. Everyone just hitting its mark. Another guy dies, and Giants are forced back. G2, after a slow start, are looking to keep fighting for that top spot. They're not done yet. They keep forcing back onto Steelback. He's done for. Shannon just 2v1ing. They're on the fountain. He's still killing them. Who cares what patch it is? G2 still fighting for the top spot here in the EU LCS. What a performance out of G2's mid and bot lane that game. You mentioned Hyanan stepping up, and if G2 want to...